Hi guys, thank you so much for tuning in and welcome to the Miss Kovedi channel. My name is Rele Wuhile Kovedi and today I'm coming to you with something completely different, something that is really out of my comfort zone. I'm going to do a hair tutorial. I'm not really good at doing my own hair but when push comes to shove, I kind of just wing it and try to come out with the cleanest looking um, aesthetically pleasing look because I feel like hair really just ties up your entire look I guess. Now that we're all up close and personal I'm gonna work with this particular lock over here. I'm gonna take my spray bottle Woo. that is really cold. I'm going to spray just maybe Yeah. My pots are not like really the best but um, I'm not really going for perfection right now. I just need something good looking <sighs> for all my video calls during the week. I think that I use a lot more product than I should. I don't really know how much I should be using, but I use like about that much. I don't know if you guys can see, I use that much. So I'm gonna just spread it on the lock and then I'm going to run my hair through the comb or run the comb through my hair. And then I'm going to just twist it and then palm roll. And then for these like bits of hair standing, I just wrap them around the lock like that. Palm roll further until you just get like that smooth roll of hair or twisted strand. And because I'm going to be working with the other section, you kind of just want to twist this further into a donut. <laughs> I don't know what to call that little thing. It's like a mini bun do not, you see, and let it sit for a while while you work through the other sections. So I'm going to pretty much do the same with this bit of hair. Squirt a little bit of water. Get some product about this much. Then I'm going to take my comb and run it through my hair and then just like like so and then just roll it up and tuck it behind my ear. So it's really just that easy. Probably need to work with these now. Yeah. I try not to pull on my hairline because I'll show you when I'm done I think that's one of the reasons why I don't actually go to my loctician anymore the guy that I used to use because he really really pulled taut on my hair and it kind of just got my hair to snap off I literally you see what I have like very very little short hair I had absolutely nothing all of that piece of hair was completely gone so it's kind of growing back now my hairline is like slowly growing back to its full glory so yeah try to stay away from putting too tight on your hairline I'm just gonna comb hair straight the best that you can do really is to just like leave hair and then maybe just work it into the whole baby hair, laying it down, 
scheme. I don't really do that because, yeah, I don't think I've found a product that's strong enough to keep my baby hair down every time I try to brush it, even with the locking gel. It just never works. So I hardly even bother. I think that's one of the reasons why I like the fringe style because then I don't really have to worry about laying down my edges that much. So at this point I've lost quite a bit of lighting but yeah I'm just gonna have to make do with what I got and I'm just gonna get right into styling my hair into the bun and fringe and for that style you just need two things two scrunchies or hair ties and that's pretty much it I usually just like find the middle because that's pretty much where my bun is going to sit and I just I don't know what I'm actually I don't know how to describe this so I unravel the little knots that I made to keep my hair sort of twisted and hold that hair up so that it doesn't unravel beyond untying the knot there are some knots that kind of came out as I twisted or palm rolled my hair so the trick there is to just like try and get them back into a twist using my other hand
Okay, so now that I have all of the hair into a little pony, we're going to try and bring it like a little bit higher because all the hair that's going to sit on the forehead actually comes from the ponytail. So the further back the bun is, it means the further back the fringe is going to start and I don't think that's going to be an appealing look so this really needs to be a very very high bun. <sighs> Yep, I think that's about where I want it to start. So I'm going to grab my big scrunchie. I'm going to make sure that all the hair is in there there we go and then we're gonna go around the second time mm. So I'm gonna start with the fringe. I always try to pick like the best locks possible. Um, not all my locks are, uh, I don't even know, up to standard. So I try by all means to pick the best, the ones that look the best. And then just like, Okay, because the locks are quite long, yeah, and we want fringe, I kind of pull a little loop here, and we're going to cover that up later, so that's not much of a problem. Um, keep that one in place, and remember we're not going for something that's like quite straight, it needs to be like very messy of different lengths. Um, yeah. I think I may have told a lie. I think I'm gonna need three at most of these scrunchies. I forgot. I have to go find another one. So I'm gonna tie those in place. I really wish that I could rock a ponytail with this look, but because of these 
this situation up here, you really can't achieve that now, can you? Um, it's very like unfinished and it's very raw. So yeah, that's pretty much what my fridge looks like right now. And I'm gonna squash these to make like a base for for my bun. Uh, and then I'm just gonna start rolling my hair into a bun. I'm gonna start constructing the bun. This is what the final look came out like. I actually really, really love it. I feel like it's very young, it's very funky, it's very, very youthful and vibrant, especially with the young makeup look I put up here. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as I did putting it together. I don't actually think I've done a hair video before. Um, yeah, I'm quite excited to edit this. But let me know how you feel about this hairstyle and if you do happen to try it make sure to tag me in your pictures on Instagram or Facebook because I'd like to see your take and your, execu your execution on this hairdo once again thank you so much for tuning in and please give this video a thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed already girl or oh guy what are you waiting for share some love with your girl and hit the subscribe button. Until next time, thank you so much for tuning in. Love you. Bye.